Mindfulness uh, is a word that is being used a lot in the contemplative traditions as well as in psychology and neuroscience. And it's been defined in different ways, but one of the ways it's been defined in the popular considerations of this term uh, is learning to pay attention on purpose, non-judgmentally. Uh, so uh, a person can uh, go through certain kinds of simple secular training where they learn to cultivate heightened attention to what is happening in the moment. And uh, to cultivate that attention in a way which promotes acceptance of whatever it is, rather than to react, to judge, um, just to accept and to be fully present with whatever may be happening in the moment. Uh, and research has investigated the impact of that kind of training on certain uh, um, elements that we may consider to be important constituents of well-being. One of them, for example, is emotion regulation. Uh, and it turns out that uh, the capacity to pay attention in that way seems to, for example, uh, facilitate our reactivity to pain um, so that we don't run away from the pain, uh, we don't um, uh, 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 exhibit uh, an overblown reaction, but we're able to actually uh, pay attention to what is occurring uh, without the same kind of suffering that often accompanies this kind of um, painful stimulus. And so this is an example of where the application of mindfulness may be um, quite important in a very pragmatic way in helping individuals to uh, cope in a more effective and skillful way with pain, which is something that uh, as we age, all of us um, will be confronting in one way or another.